Riley Cisco, and I'm currently a junior with the VTD program here at University of Idaho. Uh, I was over there at Jazz Festival showcasing the program and showing off some student work in virtual reality, which is kind of a frontier we're pushing right now. So VR stands for virtual reality, and essentially you use a headset that you stick on your face, and it has two screens that display two different images to the viewer. These two images simulate three dimensions. So you actually have full depth perception, a great sense of 3D, and uh, you, you can do a lot with it. It completely immerses you in the environment, and we can do pretty much any environment within that. So today we had two demos on display for the program. The first one was created by me. It's actually a museum that showcases work from several different students within the program. It allows students to teleport around, look around, rotate objects in the scene. And we're using what's called Elite Motion to actually capture their hands and put them into virtual reality. It adds a whole level of immersion that's really cool and really helps put the people there. And the second demo was not created by the program, but we could do it. We have the resources. It's just already been done. It's called the Blocks demo. And it's built in the Unity engine and allows players to build with blocks and push them around and change gravity. It's a really cool demo to showcase the interactivity and bring the hands into VR. Uh, I think the booth today was pretty successful. Uh, we talked to a lot of different students from all over the place and a lot of different age groups, which I kind of liked. Jazz Festival brings so many different people here. It's nice to show them our major and maybe encourage them to look into it in the future when they're looking at colleges. It helps bring up enrollment in VT, which is a big plus. So.